Hello everyone and welcome to this video where we are going to talk about the upcoming fishing update. Now the update comes out in a couple days here on Wednesday and we are super excited but one thing that I want to talk about now even before the update comes out is some of the things that we may see in the update, what to expect as well as talk about what the future may bring, maybe give some suggestions to the developers as I really like to do. So without further ado, let's begin. Now, a word of forewarning, as always, whenever I give these ideas, there's always some people that prefer to say the game should be fixed, they should work on the bugs, the glitches, etc, etc. Here, I'm going to say that I am aware of these sort of requests, and this is not the purpose of this video. The purpose of this video is to bring to the developer's attention, to our attention, some of the things that would be really cool to see in the game. Of course, as a content creator, I, my job is to make content for everyone, so I'm not just going to make video after video saying fix the bugs, that's not how this works. So these are some well thought out ideas that may hopefully add to this update. If we look into where this all began, you can start with my YouTube page and on one of my most popular videos at 8.4 thousand views, I have sort of an idea where I discuss how I'd like to see this fishing update. Now in this video I discuss both um, recreational or sport fishing as well as commercial fishing levels. So we're going to talk about some of that in this video here but you can check out this video and kind of get an understanding of what was originally discussed. Anyways this video went on to sort of be seen by the developers who then commented on it in one of their, uh, sp on the space release, they actually mentioned me by name. They also mentioned me by name. So not only am I super honored, and I know I mentioned this before, but I always like to sort of give to the developers and potentially have them make some of my ideas into a reality. So that was a huge undertaking and a huge success in my opinion. So we're going to look at this in some more detail here, but pretty much what it says is they are now adding rod fishing. So it's called rod fishing major update. They're adding rod fishing on the 31st of January on Wednesday. So they're adding a new fishing rod inventory item allows players to cast alert into the water. Okay, so you may throw a or cast alert into the water over time fish may become interested in the lure have a nibble or bite with a fish hooked, you can reel in to collect your catch. So what I imagine that is going to look like is, well, what it's saying here is that there's just going to be a fishing rod inventory item, which you then kind of use. So you interact with it in your hand, you can throw it out and you could reel it in and you grab your fish. So now it says fish can be picked up with hands dropped on the floor. Their new mechanics are similar to ore particles and so can be stored and transported in hoppers. A new hopper vacuum component can extract ore and fish from hoppers by pressing against it, pulling the contents out. Fish can be traded at a special fish gantry in some harbors. And then of course they say many thanks to the players. Um, this part is important, but is this the fishing update you wanted? I see many incredible trawlers on the workshop. If you have an idea for commercial scale fishing, we'd love to hear your thoughts and feedbacks for potential updates in the future. So you could see that they sort of mentioned this type of thing. And what we could read into this actually is that this first part is very similar to what I had originally recommended, where I even used this as an example. But I said you'd get a fishing hook or fishing reel as an inventory item. And you'd be able to throw it out and cast a line and then when fish come you'd reel it in bring it in and then of course you have a fish which you can interact with they set it properly it would be just like a particle of stone that you mine out so you then have it and you could place it in a hopper so the idea of the inventory item is pretty good like i even guessed it kind of myself and really you can then populate your ship with fishing rods as you see fit Maybe this would be a good spot for them so you can have your fishing rods kind of like this and you interact with them and access them. So that is really a great start for sport fishing or recreational fishing. Um, one thing, however, that did sort of concern me just a tad, especially for smaller fishing boats such as this, is our smallest hopper is not actually very small. 
In fact, it's still like this size. And of course, if any of you are fisher, fishermen, or if you like to go fishing in your spare free time, you'll know that normally what happens is you have kind of a cooler on your boat for the reason of putting your fish into. Uh, the hopper is a great start, especially the larger ones when you have, you know, a ship with a crane and all kinds of things. But in the case of this, call it sport or recreational sized fishing, like where you just kind of fish from a ship, to collect the fish in a hopper, I think, is great for larger scale. But for this small scale, I really would like to see a fish cooler item added. So in addition to using the hoppers, we just get a smaller item that we can put a less amount of fish. Like I don't really know how many fish fit into this mineral hopper, but I imagine we can have a cooler that is half the size, maybe fits half the fish, but on a, on a boat like this, the cooler is exactly what you'd need and want. I've built out of door panels here, sort of the size cooler that I would imagine we can have. And it would just be, it would be like a hopper, except it wouldn't be able to transfer fish to and from. So you'd have to manually sell your fish one by one. So this thing would maybe collect 20 fish or whatever the number may be, store them. And then when you come to one of the gantries, instead of using more of a commercial style crane with a hopper, you just extract your fish one at a time. Or alternatively, you could make your cooler, you know, not... Um, part of your ship but a part that's maybe attached with a um, electric connector or hard point connector or something and then you just pick up the whole cooler drag it over to your uh, selling point and sell it so that's one of those things where I think we can put on smaller boats like this where we just want to have kind of the ability to fish as well as um, be kind of mobile and a little bit real realism here too because of course when you're, when you're in a smaller style boat like this, you don't have a huge hopper to collect uh, tons of fish. But that's only the first item. We have a couple more to discuss. So here we are in our smaller, call it a cabin cruiser fishing boat. And we have reached where we want to fish. So we take out our fishing line. And then, of course, we throw it in. Now, I don't quite know the physics behind how this will work in the game so i'm just making an educated guess on wednesday we're going to see and i'm going to do a full video but as you're waiting here what we read in the description of the update would be that a fish may nibble bite etc etc what do fishermen use well bait and lures so it would be interesting in addition to getting our fishing rod item here that we're holding in our hand that we would get call it a bait so then it's something that we can pick up and throw into the water. And then, presumably, it would increase the odds of a fish coming to our area. Now, I know that they don't want to make it way too easy for us and just have kind of millions of fish and you could just fish and that's not very fun. It has to be a little bit challenging and that I am aware of. But it would be interesting to be able to throw something. And I know we have the throwing physics, we have the grenades, we have the bombs, we have all kinds of stuff. So... It would be like, but it would be nice to sprinkle it. I'd consider it more like the am ammo that you pick up and that you could like have four or whatever packs of it. So one, call it one bait box, gets you several um, dumps of the bait in the water. And you just store it in your boat and use it and it would maybe increase your odds. You just add that little extra realism and extra element to that in the game here. So that is something else, the bait and lure. Of course, when you are in your boat, what do fishermen use, especially in sport and recreational fishing? Well, fish finders. And really what that is, is a sonar that can, you know, be pinged into the ground, into the water, and it will come back and register where there is possibly schools of fish. So what I think could be neat for this smaller um, recreational or sport style fishing would be to have a fish finder and really all it would be is a sonar that we have in our um that we have on the hull of our boat down here and it would be smaller than the current sonar we have and it would be specifically tuned to find fish now that may include some 
mo some coding, some changes for the developers because right now, I know that fish can register in um, in like a scan when you're using a laser sensor, but I don't think that fish right now can register on sonar pings. But it would be neat to have that added. So right now you see that we have these sonar units. So we have a large, we have the sonar large, depreciated, medium, small, and this one. So this sonar here, it's pretty small. I mean, this one is okay for boats. And realistically, this one would probably be enough. But it would be neat to have one that is much smaller and that doesn't use, um like this one goes 60 kilometers, which is still a substantial amount. I think what we'd need to have is like, you know, one kilometer 500 meters something like quite small and this thing would be small and some boats even have them on the side like they're not permanent setups but rather you have like your uh your fish finder attached and then sort of just dropped into the water where you could use it and find fish as you go so it doesn't have to be a permanent hull mounted system but just knowing stormworks i'd presume it would be a permanent style type of uh, sonar which is still fine honestly which leads us now to the next part of our fishing update and that would be to have fishing rod mounts or holders now i know i mentioned that in my video in the past but we right now th what the uh, update says is that we'd have our fishing rod and we'd go and fish now maybe you have to have it in your hand in order for the fish to bite but it could be that you attach it to a specific fishing rod mount or holder and really how that would work is you just leave your fishing you'd throw out your fishing line and again we don't know the physics but imagine you throw out your fishing line and then what you do is you put your fishing rod onto your fishing mount and you could probably throw three or four of these lines out so you just throw it out and as it's out you just click it into this and boom now it's sitting in there and until there is a tug, in which case you pick it up and attend to it. So I'm curious to see, presumably we won't be able to sit and use the fishing rod, but maybe we can. So in that case, you could just do one at a time that way and kind of pass the time. But it would be interesting to have the fishing rod mount. And then that would serve sort of as a point of, you know, launching multiple rods or just kind of sit back, relax. Now, we talked about bait and lure. What would be quite interesting as well would be to have a tackle box. So that is something where you can actually store your bait into. And I'm using my uh, sort of cooler as an example here again, but it would maybe be somewhere where you can have multiple of these baits or lures, and maybe the bait and lure will attract different types of fish. So what you do then is you have um, different in like a different inventory that you could use and potentially get different fish or potentially have different success with in different areas so that all comes into the programming i'm not quite sure if they made it purely random where you can find fish or if it is going to be that certain areas have better fishing and then we have to scope it out and find it but that would be kind of interesting and neat to keep in mind exactly how that all works the last thing is a purely um call it uh uh, visual thing but I know we so I know we can set our skin our character skin to have like kind of fisherman style outfit but it would be interesting or neat to get a fisherman style uh, inventory like clothes that we can then wear and maybe it's gonna have a big hat or something and potentially keep us from getting wet or some little added bonus like that but I think it may just kind of serve to spice up the update and just give us a little bit more in there that we could use for our recreational fishing while we go about here and collect fish now i know a lot of you are interested to hear things like oh there should be large-scale fishing nets all that type of stuff and i totally do agree i agree that we should have trawlers and this is not a trawler but i imagine the deck can be repurposed into a trawler so i imagine that there could for sure be types of fishing arrangements in the future where we see trawling with nets i would love to see large-scale fishing operations commercial fishing operations as well and i think all that would really serve to add of life into the fishing update so right now it's a great start i'm quite happy with what we've seen and heard 
but I think if we get to that next level where we get a little bit more for spicing up the sport fishing and then we get a little bit more for the, well, a lot more for the commercial side of things, so the much bigger ships, the much heavy industrial style fishing, where it's not only just an inventory item, because right now, sure, like, it's an inventory item that we could use and fish, but wouldn't it be great if there was something we could actually build? So this, is this isn't the building, this is just one item that we use, but wouldn't it be cool, just like how the weapons has small arms and it has cannons, it would be great to have the fishing rod for small fishing, and then, like, massive deployable nets. I compared it in the past to the parachutes in the game, so using the physics from the parachute to sort of get the... Um, style of like massive fishing net and then you have hoppers and cranes and pulleys and you pick the thing up and drop it the fish down into a, a hold so that's all stuff that i would for sure like to see just you know talking about it and hearing it but i do think that first things first we could potentially spice up our sport fishing side of things give that just a little bit more features and playability and then of course with that excitement that that all will bring it may even bring more um, kind of ideas and creativity to the commercial and large-scale fishing operation side of things. So, thank you all for watching. Stay tuned, because later this week we're going to actually showcase this fishing update when it gets released. But for now, we're just kind of going off assumptions. And we will continue there, where maybe we make reference to what we talked about in this video, or maybe the developers address it themselves and we don't have to so thank you all for watching stay tuned for more content for more creations and as always happy storm everyone